Yo, what's going on everybody? We are backstage right now. It's only 30 minutes away from showtime and we are getting ready to put on an awesome show tonight. So, oh, yo, what up, Drew? Y'all ever wonder what happens behind the scenes? You've seen our show and we've given you a few sneak peeks here and there, but I think it's time to give you guys a whole new look on what we do. Yo, what's going on, Troy? Anyway, it's time to give you guys a more up close and personal look at behind the scenes. So we are proud to introduce a brand new weekly series that gives you just that. It's time to show you what happens behind the magic. I'm Vincent. Bad boy. <laughs> I am an adrenaline junkie. Anything that would give me an adrenaline rush, I would, I would do. I have the angel wings tattooed on my back because I kind of overcame this this mischievous uh, young man that I used to be, and. Uh, it made me a better person, so. I met Vinny almost seven years ago when this whole thing was just getting started. Mal is very, very intelligent. He's more than just a host. He is actually the engine that drives the machine. I got started in this business just after high school by going to work for my uncle who's been in this industry since 1989. He taught me a lot about the business and eventually I started my own company with the goal of making the industry better. I've known Miles for quite a few years. We go way back. A friend of mine told me about Miles and said, you know, this guy is a lot more aggressive, he's younger, he's got a lot more drive, and I think the company that he is building right now is gonna be better than what you're doing. So, I gave him a call, went in, got an interview with him, and uh, he hired me. Vinny's one of the first guys that I ever hired. He's been there since the very beginning, and he's always been one of the fan favorites. He's just got the stage presence, unlike anybody I've ever seen before, and he's one of the best guys that I know. Vinny is a wild child. <laughs> he um, loves hard and plays harder. Loves to put on a great show. He's passionate about everything that he does. He doesn't settle for anything less than exactly what he wants. And he's not okay with being average in anything. Um, couldn't ask for a better person to work with. I look up to him in many ways, not just as a fitness role model, but you know, as, a, as a person. So I've learned a lot from him. And as a teammate, as a member of this family, you couldn't, you couldn't ask for a better person to call a brother. I went to school for uh, kinesiology and nursing. A while back, I, uh, I had an accident that led me to be where I am today. Being the adrenaline junkie that I am, I dove in some shallow water and, and broke my neck. It was pretty severe. I spent 10 days in the ICU. Uh, I would stop breathing throughout the night, and they had me on 24-hour watch. Uh, they were really afraid I was going to get paralyzed. Um, luckily I didn't. Vinny breaking his neck was one of the hardest times for me. He uh, had become a very close friend of mine, uh, really like a big brother, and seeing him in that condition was very tough, and I just wanted to do anything I could to help. At that same time, I was working for Miles, and luckily he threw a benefit for me to help me get through that time financially because I was unable to work. You know, hindsight, if that wouldn't have happened, I, I, would, be, I would be nursing right now, but honestly, that being put to the back burner to be a part of this, to me, is well worth it. And now I get to experience life in a different way that I never would have before. Mm -hmm. 